Hello, it's James. How are you all doing today? So today we're down back in the uh, local woodland and we're going to be looking for a uh, woodland bird. Um, so there should be some robin, chaffinch, chiff chaff, nuthatch, woodpeckers, blue tits, great tits and cold tits knocking about in this area for a, a definitive. Maybe it's even some uh, tree creepers. Uh, the main reason I'm down today is I'm actually wanting to start planning out where some of these nests are in the woods so I can try and watch them actually feeding their young and wait for the fledglings to actually come out. So I thought I'd bring you on this journey today for my little uh, recce to find different nests and different birds today. So yeah, let's have a look what we see. do like this particular little patch this beautiful little glade all the flowers are just starting to come through now just a beautiful beautiful backdrop with absolutely tons of natural bird song so there's some nut hatch in this tree in front of me and uh, doing some really different behavior to what I'm used to there are uh, they're hanging around one particular tree, so I'm guessing this is going to be where their nest is going to be. And they're actually chasing off all of the birds. So I'm going to see if I get the big camera zoomed in. I'm going to keep watching them and see if we can actually find out where their nest hole is going to be. So I've been watching these nuts hatch for a little while now and it looks like the spot that I've got my camera in right now is the proposed nest. Now this seems to be a bit of a bit of a fight between the great tits and the nut hatch for this particular nest. So I'm going to go see if I can uh, leave my camera set up on that position for a little bit and see if we can catch them scrapping in the doorway. So let's see what we see. So it looks like I was right, there does seem to be a bit of a bit of a territory battle, a bit of point of contention for that particular hole. So uh, now that I've found this one, I'm going to go see if I can find any more. And I will come back to this one uh, in a couple of weeks time and see who, uh, see who won. The great things about finding nests at this time of the year is that some of the birds haven't actually laid eggs yet. So what you can do is find them while the leaves aren't on the trees and come back once their young ones are starting to actually be fed and hatched and fledged. So finding them now means that you can get more interesting shots later down the line. So just up here in the trees here is the actual uh, greater spotted woodpecker nest. So if we wait here long enough, we should hopefully get some footage of them uh, actually feeding their young. So just down here on top of this post inside the ivy there's actually a blue tit nest and behind this tree uh, at the back there's a slit in it and there's actually a great tit nest in there as well so so far so good on the uh, on the nest count. So some of you might be wondering how I'm finding all these different nests and the best way to find them is if you just follow a bird and if it's got food or it's got uh, nesting material in its mouth, if you keep following it, eventually you'll see that it will go to its nest and either build or feed young. Um, so that's how I'm doing this. I'm kind of looking around in the woods, just keeping my eyes peeled for any bird that's kind of carrying anything at all and then just following it back to where it goes. And uh, you just keep watching and all of a sudden you'll see it's actually a bit of a pattern of routine and almost an amount of time you can um, wait before you know it's going to start arriving again. 
Right, that's about all I've got time for today. So I'm going to uh, make moves and get back home and have a cup of tea. Uh, thank you all for joining me, and I hope to see you next time. Ta-ra!